This is one of the most dangerous places in the world to be a journalist. Last year, 18 journalists were killed here. Since the beginning of this year, at least five others have died. But the industry is now facing a new threat. Tougher media legislation, which will come into force from next month. The information ministry says it merely wants to improve professionalism in the media. Oh. This new law has been approved by the cabinet and all that remains is for it to be approved by parliament. It's up to the federal parliament to debate, make changes and amend the proposed Somali media bill before the president signs it into law. But many Somali journalists fear the bill will stop them from doing their job properly and limit the freedom of the media. There are a number of contentious issues in the proposed bill that we want amended before it's debated by the House. Key among them is the issue of forcing journalists to reveal their sources. The United Nations is also worried. We're particularly concerned that the draft legislation contains vague language and extremely broad categories that could easily be used to curtail freedom of expression. Uh, for instance, requiring media not to contravene or disseminate information that is against Islam, against Somali traditions, or against traditional ethics. Protecting sources is a golden rule in journalism. It's seen as critical if the public is to gain access to correct and balanced information. Worldwide, many journalists have been jailed or suffered worse for refusing to reveal their sources. Mohammed Hirmoge, CCTV, Mogadishu.